I'm so confused. Hi, I'm Kokichi. Just got out of dormancy. Dor dormancy. Dormancy. I can't fucking speak. Anyway, uh, don't know what the fuck's going on. I have yet to gain back my memories, which is a little bit worrying, but I mean, I don't care. Uh, anyway, what the fuck is going on? wouldn't say we're completely qualified to answer this since we only know our own experiences, but if you're suspecting that you might be a part of a system, then the best thing you can do is research. It can include talking to multiple systems. We do wish you the best of luck in finding out what's going on, and if you want a link to our DM server on Cord, just DM us and we'll slide it over. Hope you have a nice night. Sucks. I'm an artist from the middle of nowhere. I've never gotten lucky or had any overnight success because I refuse to sell my soul. My life fucking sucks. Girl in a straw hat with her arms out in a cornfield. That is a scarecrow. Ridget. Ridget. Woof. Woof. Hey, uh, I'm Z. What's up? Uh, um, hi, I'm Oliver. How did ever get so wrong? Crying in the stall of a washroom floor. You niggas don't know where I'm from. Don't know how I got it, but I'm all alone. So I have makeup on. This is what it's like to have DID waking up with makeup on. I mean, I feel pretty. I feel pretty. It's okay. <laughs> Hi, I'm Mort. Crikey, my name's Steve! Uh, I don't feel comfortable telling you my name. And I would love to explain to you how doing this making fun of alters thing trend is offensive. <laughs> my name's Leaf. Hey, it's me, Ol Ol Oliver. Could you fall in love with me again? Tell me how I should make a man Oh my darling, please never let me go There's just one thing that maybe you should know I love them pretty lies, pretty lies, pretty lies Signs that your girlfriend has ADHD she refuses to understand the concept of personal space. These, these keys right here, yeah, they might as well be infinity stones because guess what? She's not gonna find them. Yeah, that's part one of. Hey there, my name is Iris and I'm a part of the DID system and today I wanted to talk about fictives. We personally don't. Okay, I'm gonna switch. Fuck off. <laughs> well, this is nice. <laughs> this is Jackson. <laughs> I haven't been here in a, in a little while. This is... Wow. <laughs> what up? It's Jonas. I switched in again unexpectedly while editing this video, so I'm gonna do my best. <laughs> Fan art contest. Whoever wins gets to be my PFP. Hi, um, my name is Susie. Um, 
you can call me Chalk if you want, um, or Arsenic. Um, I'm new to the system, and uh, I can't fucking decide on a name. But my name is Susie. That's my that's my original name. But I can't decide on what my preferred name is. Um, my pronouns are they, she, he. I guess I like he him pronouns. I like she her pronouns. I like they them pronouns. I don't really care. Um, can you get off of me? Ugh. And apparently, the body is disabled. I can't kick people's ass anymore. Someone just suggested to me that I can hit them with this. Okay. Anyway, hi. Ready to go in. The last time I freaked out, I just kept looking down. I still still stutter when you ask me what I'm thinking about. But like I couldn't breathe. One, I tricked everyone, starting with you, the head, the loser kids in town, and the prefects. Me, I won. You are sad, man. Oh. I might be sad, but I run your world, moron. And don't. I feel like there's a bit of a miscommunication here, so please allow us to clear some things up. All alters are different people, individuals, and they genuinely are the age that they experience themselves to be. Each alter has independent willpower and agency and desires and hopes and dreams. And this is part of the balancing act that every single system has to constantly keep up. We would like to make it abundantly clear, none of us are attracted to minors, but none of us are teenagers. Adrian's not old enough to have that sort of thought process. And part of system responsibility is sort of acting your meat body's age, even if you're not as old as the meat body is. And that means Taking the steps to preempt any kind of uncomfortable situation developing. System responsibility means we don't go hanging out with teenagers, so even if we had a teenage alter. We don't know of any systems that are adults who have a minority of adult alters. Which is to say, by the time it becomes inappropriate, the majority of this, any system is going to be mature enough and developed enough to have control over what their meat body does. Like, can't control the desires of the individuals that just so happen to be sharing a brain with them. And if that makes you uncomfortable, I'm sorry, I'm just, you, you, just, you just can't stop it. They're people. But, as a system, you have the ability to decide what to do, and again, we, we don't know of any, of any systems that would choose to put themselves in that kind of predicament. So I guess a good analogy for this that I just thought of would be like, it, uh, forbidding your teenage child to date a certain person. Obviously you can't stop the kid from having an attraction, you can set appropriate boundaries and and assert your influence over them so that nobody gets hurt. It really warms our heart that you're so concerned and invested. Thank you for asking. Thanks for watching.